Listen. It's because, it, see, that it, it, it's just one religion that really counts, and that is the religion of white supremacy. All of the other people are tempted to practice their religion. Most people who have a religion are very, very sincere. In, uh, and they prove it by their actions and whatnot up until the time that the white supremacists step forward and say, well, now, you can practice this part of your religion. You know, if you want to have a picnic or something like that, I don't mind that. You know, if you want to clap your hands or you want to sing and whatnot, I don't mind that. Uh, just help yourself. That's not bad for my business. But if I want to kill people and all like that, you better not start saying, thou shalt not kill, and this start interfering with me while I'm doing my... Mm -hmm. or I will kill you. And they have proven that they will do that. Mm -hmm. And people fear that. And they let people know. Now you yeah. have as many gods as you want. But when I tell you to do something, you better jump. Like I'm your god. Because for all practical purposes, I am. Now you might have a god in heaven, but I'm the one who rules you on this planet. So you can sing about after you're dead all you want to. Just don't mess with me while we're both walking around on the same planet. Because this is my planet. You don't own none of it. And you don't have anybody anywhere in the spiritual world or the material world that can help you when I get on your case. And most people so far have backed down when the voice of the white supremacists come into the picture. And some of them haven't backed down. And most of them who didn't back down are dead. Who are you? You don't know? Don't tell me Negro, that's nothing. What were you before the white man named you a Negro? And where were you? And what did you have? What was yours? visual than ever. 